But one of the things I love to do is to make room for people's imagination. I want to make sure that they find a great deal of room to see new things for themselves in my windows. Designing windows for different buildings with different clients must be a unique experience each time. How do you approach that? I spend time in the building. I listen to the light of the building. I listen to what the architect has to say about what he or she has created. If it's a religious building, I spend some time attending their services. With secular buildings, I try to attend some kind of social function. And I put all of that together and uh, spend time making several a whole series of sketches and from that series of sketches I try to find something that is, is working and exciting me and then I pursue that. I, I keep sketching out that one idea, bringing it into colour, sometimes pastel, other times it's watercolour, simply line drawings, collage. I use all kinds of media to try and develop my ideas. And once I feel really comfortable with the idea, I present that to the client. So then, do clients have a lot of input into how their windows are going to look? I would say they have a lot of input. I don't ask them what kind of an image they would like to see. I really think that as an artist that that's my work, to find the image for them, find the image of who they are. But they certainly have input in telling me who they are, telling me a bit of their history and their story. And that's what I use as a foundation to build my windows.